guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to add animated arrows, boxes, and circles in Camtasia. Okay, so something like this would be useful if you want to draw attention to something on the screen and you need it to be outlined or pointed to. So I've got a screenshot here. This was just a random screenshot that I took of our YouTube analytics last night. And I'm going to show you guys how to add the animated arrows, boxes, and circle shapes. So first thing you want to do is have your media, whether it be a video or a picture, and then head over to annotations. And then you go all the way down to the squiggly line and that is called sketch motion callouts. So here you're going to have a selection and there's going to be two kinds. So there's going to be like as if for someone were drawing it. So this circle, the way it looks, it looks like someone like actually did it or you're going to have like a perfect circle. Same with the square. It's going to look like someone just, you know, did it freehand or a perfect square. And I'll show you guys uh, the two differences here. So the arrow, let's do the arrow. You just want to just drag it down to the screen and then it's going to look something like this. Now you can play around with it so you can change the color of it and you can change the thickness of it. I like it to be a little bit more thicker because if it's down here it's too thin, can't really notice it. So I like it to be something like this and then the draw time. So the draw time is the actual animation part that's already embedded into these uh, shapes. So I'm just going to play it and it's one second that it takes to draw in. That's the draw time. So you can make that faster or slower and you can just choose here flip horizontally or vertically. So if you want to go like that, something like that. You can also go here and um, switch the angle of it. So you grab the green dot and you can angle it, right? So let's say I wanted to point to this number right here. Then I would angle it and then you can shorten it, make it wider or make it thinner, something like that. And then you can arrange it. So I'll, sh I'll show you the other arrow as well. So this is more of the, the perfect arrow. And I'll have it. You can see here it's much more structured. And you can again change the thickness of it. So you can see it's more, a, more of a perfect arrow. And you can change the angle of it. Make it smaller, wider, just shape it accordingly if you want to do something like that. And then we've also got the circle and square shapes which are going to go around whatever you're trying to show. So let's say we want to grab the rough circle one. So I'll grab that one, place it down here and it's going to come out as a wide circle but you can thin it out. Let's say you want to circle this, make this a little bit thicker, widen it, and then if you play it, it's going to look like someone's actually circling it. And then this is more of the perfect circle. Let's say I want to circle this one make it a bit thicker and I'll show you at the same time. So you can see one's got a little bit more of a rough effect. I do like using this one more. It's what I usually use with the box as well, but I mean it's your preference. And here's the rectangle square one. You can do something like this. Stretch it out. And then we'll press play. So it's really cool if you 
really just want to obviously show something on the screen and point to a number. This is one of the ways that you can do that is with the animated sketch motion. So that is how you add animated arrows, boxes, and circles in Camtasia. If you guys like these videos, I have a nine plus hour Camtasia course that you guys can get two months free access to for free by heading down to the description below. I have a ton of tutorials in there just like this one and stuff that I've even created that aren't anywhere else. So you can get two months free access down in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Back, back, back from the dead.